What is up YouTube, Flourish RC, and I'm back with a Madden 16 Ultimate Team game here on the PS4, and I'm sorry, I totally forgot to bring you guys the first season playoffs with the PS4 team. Uh, the team still had like Drew Brees on it, uh, you guys saw me make a lot of upgrades on it, you saw that video a couple days ago, but uh, this is the team back like three weeks ago, like a month ago, and I totally forgot to show you guys the playoffs. So here it is, we're in the divisional round of the playoffs, still undefeated on the season, which is pretty badass, and look at Dan! Danny Trevathan going up there, making that catch. What a spectacular grab by the middle linebacker. So we're going to give the ball to D'Angelo Williams on the toss. Takes a big hit from Barry Church. Luckily, he holds on to the ball, but fumble, I don't know, like... For some reason, I feel like hit power like doesn't matter at all. And then Doriel Green back him into the end zone for the touchdown. Things are looking good. Things are looking up for us already. You guys know on my PS4 team, it's a budget team. We like to go quick and fast, okay? We like to keep the pace up, keep the pedal to the metal. We love playing like that. That's exactly how I play. You know, balls to the wall, freaking just going as fast as we can, air it out kind of offense. You guys know we don't really run the ball too much. We decide to pass it a lot on this team for whatever reason. I'm not quite sure, but that's what we do. And look at Roby just laying out David Johnson on that play. So we're now third down and three. Going to go with the fullback dive to Mike Tolbert. He's going to get the first down easy, no problem. So first down and ten, looking to pass the ball. Once more, <laughs> how did I not get that pick? I was like right in front of the ball. I thought for sure they'd give me that pick, but they didn't. So second down and five, going deep across the middle of the field. He's got, I believe, Brandon Marshall for a first down. That was pretty big. He had, he's really struggled at moving the ball so far in the first quarter, so that was a big play that he really needed to get on the other side of the field. Back our big hit by Jamie Collins pushes him back. Now second down and ten, looking to pass again, and Danny Trevathan gets in front of the ball again and picks it off. Don't test my users, man. Like, seriously, like, why are you testing me for? And then we get sacked by Ezekiel Anza. Yeah, he had team of the year Ezekiel Anza. Pretty interesting. And then once again, we're just calling some four verts. Not a smart idea. Luckily, we are able to get rid of it before we even go back further. So, third down and 22. What's the game plan? Well, I caught him in a cover two, and the PA shot works perfectly to Emmanuel Sanders. 92 overall, Emmanuel Sanders going to showboat into the end zone for the touchdown, and we just caught him in that cover two. You know, I was hoping he'd be calling a cover two, and he was, and we just burnt him over the middle of the field on that PA shot play and just worked perfectly. And that 92 of Emmanuel Sanders, pretty damn good. I don't think I have any more. I replaced him with Stephon Diggs, but still, when I had that Emmanuel Sanders, he was an absolute stud. Absolutely amazing. Love that card. And once again, Trevathan almost picked that. Like, they're kind of cheating me. I know I already have two picks, but I feel like I should have two more. Like, I should have four user picks with Trevathan right now. They've cheated me out of a couple of them. So, first down and ten, looking to pass again. And my users are just on point this game. Now, I'm a, Trevathan's not too fast, so I'm a little bit behind. But trust me, if I had Anthony Barr or anyone with, like, 90-plus speed, I, I, he wouldn't get anywhere on me because I am just all over. I know exactly what he's trying to do. Like, right there again. Again, don't test the users. He's just getting downright disrespectful, and I'm making him pay for it. Trevathan's got three picks. Three user picks by Danny Trevathan in the first half. How many are we going to get by the end of the game? I don't know. Emmanuel Sanders hitting the juke move, and Emmanuel Sanders just skinned through three people, three defenders, and he's into the end zone for another touchdown. Things looking spectacular for us. And again, with the PS4 team, I don't know what it is. Maybe it's because I'm in, like, the lowest string you can be in Madden. Maybe that's why. But I just, like, my games, just my offense, it's firing. It's always just out there doing amazing things. And they just come out firing. Like, my offense is just hard to stop. Like, I can score almost at will with this team, and I absolutely love that. And I thought that was a pick. I thought I could get that on the ricochet, but I don't. So, third down and ten, what's he going to do? He's going to test my users again. This time, it's Wilson who gets the pick. I don't even know. Some, like, silver safety I have is my nickel safety. I don't even know who he is. Man, four user picks. Wow, four user picks in the first half. Like, man, just you, you should just like not throw it anywhere near my player. Just like avoid my player at all costs right now. And you know, again, I'm not trying to sit here and say that I have the best users in like the history of Madden, but I think I have some pretty damn good users. You know, not they're not like amazing, but they're pretty good. You know, if you throw it anywhere close to me, then you, pretty much it's gonna be picked off. You can almost guarantee it. Um, I'm fairly good at reading routes, which is you know, per pretty nice, but that comes with playing Madden for a while. Like, if you guys probably watched my Madden 15 videos, like the start of my channel, 
I wasn't that good, you know. Madden 15 was really the first Madden I like got into playing it like a lot. You know, I would always play Madden like occasionally, but just for fun. You know, but this like Madden 15 was the first year I really started playing like a lot, playing it per pretty much it became like my first game, you know, the game that I played more than anything else. So if you look at my videos back then, I had like no users whatsoever. Like I had no clue what I was do hell half the time I I didn't even like user control the player i just like you know had like my user on my safety but i didn't touch my controller i just let the computer do everything and then if the ball happened to be in my area i would just pull the wide pick it off but uh you know again you know it comes with playing a lot and just learning what people do and how to read um how to read offenses how to read routes all that stuff and look at brown making that catch no clue how he made it but somehow he's able to make that catch but uh yeah so you know again you know just practice your users you know if you're struggling with trying to use her just practice that's really all i can say is practice but the main thing is like don't don't overcommit. like you know if you like keep your player pretty much in your res respective zone you know like if you're calling like a zone coverage Make sure that the player you're using pretty much stays in their zone. That's how you blow coverages, especially if you're if you're using like a safety. If you're using a linebacker, just pretty much just cover the middle of the field, and you'll pretty much be fine. At least that's what I do. But again, I'm not the best Madden player in the world, so you know you can take tips from me if you want, but you don't have to. But you know, so and plus, usering is a lot easier nowadays than it. You know, I remember it used to be in Madden. In Madden, usering never used to be very easy. This year. It's pretty damn easy. So you can see my game freezes, but it doesn't freeze. This is when someone like pulls their Ethernet cable out or they just turn off their PlayStation and then uh, the game freezes for a little bit and he's out of here. So I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm Fluttershot. Peace out. And as usual, have a great day, guys.